everyone. Oh my god, I'm starting the vlog in the new house. We're just measuring our space. Our boxes that were being shipped from Melbourne to here has not arrived. So we literally have nothing. Like we don't have our furniture or any of that. That's arriving next week. So we've just been furniture shopping in the meantime. And I guess the unpacking will start next week. And we start our new jobs next week as well. So this really feels like the calm before the storm. We're gonna do some measuring today because we've really been eyeing a couch and a dining table set and both are on sale so we really want to see and look in that decision so we get the good price but we'll see if everything fits so i'm back at my parents house as you can see i have a bunch of packages to open so Maya was having a stock take sale recently and i didn't want to miss on the sales because i was eyeing a bunch of like home items so I got all of these delivered to my cousin Bernadette so this one um, my cousin accidentally opened so just 10 scented oils to go with my new diffuser it's like a canister for the bathroom cute ah it's a boss lovely my new European pillow we are upgrading to a queen bed for our master bedroom now that we've moved into the new house. So I thought I would have a go at doing like proper bedding where it looks really cute and you've got like all the pillows, maybe a throw. So we'll see. This is the Lazy Susan, <laughs> a masher. I didn't realize it was gonna be this big. <laughs> she is a statement piece. I'm honestly just gonna use it as a fruit bowl. Oh, that will look really nice in the kitchen. It's so heavy. I can squat this. I also bought this pillow candle. Oh, I like this color a lot actually. The last item which I am most excited for. This is the In Essence 360 diffuser. Oh my god, it's so pretty. <gasps> I have no idea how I got it. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> I bought a few of these like cabinet, pantry, cupboard liners from Ikea. So we're gonna start doing that. I definitely think we're gonna need more rolls, but I might start with the pantry because we actually have food that we can put into our pantry. <laughs> It's a Saturday and it's the first weekend in our house so we've been doing a lot of unpacking like after work where we can but he and I started our new jobs this week as well so it's been super hectic but I'm gonna show you the progress that we've made so far and also what we still have to go through we have so much stuff and luckily everything seems to be in really good condition so far like nothing's been damaged by the move but i will say we have noticed like a few missing items so hopefully it's just a matter of following up and having those items returned to us for example i couldn't find like my custom art prints we're missing like a piece of our dyson vacuum so fingers crossed we haven't just lost them, but it's okay because we did get insurance for all our stuff. But anyway, let me show you the progress so far. Okay, so this is what the pantry is looking like. This is the cabinet. I feel pretty good about this. All our plates and all our Tupperware containers. But under the stove, we've got all these pots and pans. Yay! Emptied all of these boxes also emptied out these boxes and you know they had all the appliances in there so we might end up just keeping all of these boxes and storing them in our garage this is really where everything else is this is our like media entertainment room that projector and that screen came with the house 
Anyway, yeah, we still have so much to unpack. Our friend Dennis just helped us kind of set up the TV unit, which was so helpful. And I'm just starting to style it. Of course, yesterday I had to do a Kmart run and I'll show you what I got. I just got these pegs for our clothesline. Can you believe we've survived for so long without pegs? We got this measuring jug. Again, something that I've wanted for a really long time and I just put it off. Put a bunch of these containers to help organize, especially in the bathrooms under the sink because I have so many toiletries. So these will be very helpful. I'm sick of the crates that we have in the pantry already. I bought those originally for our wedding, but we didn't end up using them. But I'm not loving them because we have to assemble each one. And I found these that don't need any assembly. So I just bought two and I'll see how I go with them. It's a Friday night and Ki just got home. We're about to head out for dinner to a Vietnamese restaurant. We haven't been there before, but check the reviews and it looks good. And they're the only ones that we can find a table at. So hopefully it's good. And we're just about to head over to my brother and sister-in-law's house. We're gonna go feed their dogs because they're currently on a staycation. So we will do that before we head to the Vietnamese restaurant. <laughs> 